There is an amazing community of people uh, who are hugely talented and have very strong, deeply felt views based on really difficult lived experiences. Back before I even knew about the intersex community, I felt alone in the struggle of my life and what I had to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. It was really, really tough. I was born with a different body. I still have, despite the surgery, a body that's different. There was lack of conversation or engagement or even sharing of information. It impacted on the fact that I didn't have a relationship till I was 28 because I didn't want to be seen naked. It impacted my health because I didn't want to go to change rooms. It impacted what I wore and how I uh, engaged with other students at school. I'd say to my younger self that you're intersex and go find someone else who's intersex because you're not actually alone. Even if you have been raised in a situation where you don't feel profoundly ashamed, this society still does not value and recognise difference. So I don't think you get that until you get to hang out, laugh, cry, play with other people like yourself. I've taken control back of what it means to be intersex, what it means to be in my body and to be living in my body on a day-to-day -day basis. Coming to a place where I've met intersex people who I can sort of share my experiences with, it's given me confidence, it's sort of liberated me and given me, I suppose, a new life really, like an entirely new way of living, an entirely new way of seeing myself and being myself. There's no community in the world that doesn't have intersex people. I spent a lot of time being very angry, very confused, and none of that was necessary.